A minute to go. Nazar Markovic. Well, that's it. The final whistle. Well, it turned out to be a different kind of game to the one perhaps we set up for you at the beginning. Very one-sided. Yeah, you end up feeling a bit disappointed as a neutral because we didn't really get a contest, but the winning team won't be disappointed at all. Played well. I think he was the best performer in a good team today. Yeah, I mean, we thought he might be the danger man out there, Martin, didn't we? And that's how it turned out. Probably the difference between the two teams. Working hard just to see. Maybe saw the goal and went for it. We're here to describe the action for you. Nice to have you with us, Martin Tyler here Leicester and City Alan Smith. And Cardiff City. Cardiff City in our match today against Leicester City. Cardiff City lineup. Number 18, Greg Cunningham. Number four, Sean Morris. Now this is the Cardiff City lineup today for you. He looks as though the manager has set up a team here. Whatever happens, we're not going to be beaten today. Does look that way, doesn't it? And uh, I hope it's not a dull affair, this big stuff. Just concentrating on a clean sheet. Harry Arter. And number 33, Julio Hoyer. This is the Leicester City lineup. Casper Schmeichel starts in goal. Matty James starts with Andy King in midfield. And in attack, Kalechi Ikhianacho. Cardiff City, they'll be looking for another win. They played so well last time out, it was an away victory against Liverpool. Should be buoyant after that 3 0 win, but uh, probably a draw for them here. Thank you, enjoy the game. So the first half about to begin. Morrison. Bamba. Here's Bennett. Goodison. Salah. They tried to keep it, but they haven't been able to do that. Now it's Kalechi Ikinacho. It's King. 
could have been in really until the interception. Good vision here. He's through here. It was a chance maybe to hit the target. He certainly went for strength. Nothing wrong with the connection either. Fuchs. It's Gray. And the ball played to Mendy. Gezal. Leicester City like to get the ball forward and they're doing it here. Some options now for the pass. A good run towards the near post. Oh, they get there first. Going for goal. Off the post. So close, inches away. But they are playing well. I fancy him to get another chance and uh, get the noses in front here. That's one way out of that situation with a back heel, but the opposition saw it coming. Murphy. Out into the wide areas now. Can whip it in now. Whipped in from the wide area. They've soaked up a lot of danger here, but it hasn't hurt them, and now they're on the ball. Mendy. Here's a chance to go down the outside of the opposition. Far too close, the cross to the keeper. Joseph Bennett. Gunnarsson. Well, oh, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Gunnarsson trying to find a way through here, probing away. It's a pass, another pass. At the moment, just giving them possession and not much more than that. Oh, that's good defending. Trying to stretch the opposition, using the wider areas here. Shots on here. Difficult skill, good effort. Yeah, timed it perfectly, as you have to do with those volleys. Johnny Evans, as for the visitors, their first choice centre-back is out with a suspension. Yeah, and they're going to have to do their fair share of defending, so... Uh... That centre-back, I think he'll be missed. Threads it through. Well, the flag's up. He's frustrated because he is caught offside. Maybe he made his run a bit too soon. Gunnarsson. Morrison. Pass the ball a bit better than this if they're going to make progress. Couldn't it straight away? Lost his marker, probing pass. He's cut it back looking for a teammate. Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. In goes the corner. Not able to take full advantage of a good position. And now the shot! danger to the goal has gone with that clearance Ricardo Pereira the good position for the cross there will be a minimum promising build up minutes. until that challenge Salah came in with a challenge so it's half time and we're Start of the second half for you. Oh, he's good at cutting those passes out in that middle of the park. An incisive pass. Now Ikea Nacho. And then it goes towards the far post. And he bangs it away. It can be quick on the break now. Here 
is Ichianacho. Mendy with good vision. Delivered into the box. Salah. Junior Hoylet. Good answer. And that's good support as they build this attack. And they're keeping the ball. That's the important thing. Had a go! And a little touch over the bar from the goalkeeper. They've had to do a lot of defending this team over the last, uh, what, 10, 15 minutes. But on the front foot, they could go ahead here. This might be dangerous from the corner. He's put in the corner. Cleared away by the defender. Ricardo Pereira. James. How about Leicester City's next game, Alan? Well, they're playing Burnley in their next match. I think they'll cope with it well. I think they'll get through easily. Down on the bench, some activity for Leicester. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. That would be a throw. Substitution for Leicester City coming and Here we're going to have a substitution. And it seems as though it's for tactical reasons. And the away team want to make a change. Gregory Cunningham. Gunnarsson. Bamba. Here's Bennett. Some options now for the pass. Morrison, Gregory Cunningham, Gunnarsson, Morrison, Bamba. Here's Bennett. Good forward play from them. Got his foot in to cut out the pass. Done well under pressure here to hold the ball as the challenge came in. James guiding it through the defenders. In with a chance. Got the opposition back pedalling a little bit. That's a decent header, but it's not quite good enough. Well, they're going to get tighter to him because he's a really good header of the ball. He showed it there. Matty James to be replaced by number 20, Shinji Okazaki. Now the countdown is to 10 minutes left. Great interception. They're looking to make the change now as quickly as possible, the home team. Okazaki. Mbidi. Gezal. Now Nacho. Read that well with the interception. Been a great contest. And no one has got their noses in front now with five minutes to go. Bamba. Here's Bennett. Please give a round of applause for today's man of the match, number 17, Aaron Gunnarsson. Now it's Kelechi Ikinacha. Indeedy. I don't to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. We've got two added minutes. Gezal. It's Leicester still attacking in these closing minutes, trying to get the decisive goal. He's aiming for the front post. Defended well. Could get the ball into the box now. That's it. Level pegging between the two teams. And it's finished all square. Well, for the league progress, something in it for both sides.
but a draw these days never feels quite as uh, satisfying as perhaps it used to in the old days when you got two points only for a win. Yeah, I think looking back on it, when they look at the DVD, both uh, managers and sets of players will be dis disappointed feeling that they could have won it, but neither could. Alan Smith is with me. I'm Martin Tyler. Delighted to have your company for this match today. Cardiff City in our match today against Brighton and Hove Albion. Cardiff City liner. Number 18, Greg Cunningham. Number 4, Sean Where on earth are the goals going to come from for the visiting team today? given the paucity of their scoring records so far. Well, everybody bears responsibility, not just the strikers at set pieces, the defenders going up. Number 11, Josh Murphy. Number 7, Harry Arter. And number 33. Here's the 11 fielded by Cardiff City today. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually. They get backed up by a teammate. They hunt in packs, and you've got to do that. You've got to do it with discipline. Brighton will play 
with these players today. Dan Byrne replaces Montoya, who's looked vulnerable recently. And the last player on the team sheet is the one main forward. Cardiff City will be looking to get a victory here. They need a victory, really. Last time out, they were at home. They couldn't find a winning goal and drew against Leicester City. No, I mean, a bit unlucky in the nil-nil draw. Forwards have plenty of chances. I think they'll make amends with a win today. Cunningham. Morrison. Gunnarsson. chance to go in front but he's missed it incredible but well, he can't believe it his teammates can't either proper there seems to be a bit of a switch or a, a certainly an upgrading of the clubs on the south coast and the southampton who dropped to the third tier uh, he's reached it and turned it aside that's a corner Put the corner in the middle. It's a corner that's been wasted, really. Stopped at the near post. Maybe he'll cross it here. I think the opposition looks as though they believed they'd get through them, but they haven't, and now they can get on the ball and play. Just to go back to Brighton, a seaside town on the south coast, a holiday resort. Shouldn't have any problems attracting players to come and uh, live in the area. Yeah, it's one. One of those where it's a nice place to live and sometimes that uh, works against you but uh, I think that's all down to the manager uh, heading in the right direction and uh, a player with ambition will want to join I'd imagine looking a problem until the probing the pass off his line quickly the keeper to get that had to be Cunningham Really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress. Well, he saw the guy could switch the play to and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. Oh, that's good defending. Oh, that would have looked great if it had flown in, but in the end it didn't fly very close at all. No, he looked a bit embarrassed after that effort. Shane Duffy. Pascal Gross. Gross. This is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening. It's a good cross. And he's opened the scoring here. That was a top class goal. The defenders seem to lose the concentration almost. They saw it coming from a long way out. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Takes on the shot. No doubt that's a corner. And in it goes. And it's a goal here. Oh, that was schoolboy stuff. Having just scored, they concede at the other end. Lack of concentration.
That was a goal of deluxe class. <laughs> it was a nice corner, and didn't he attack it well? It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Duffy. David Prepper. Jose Esquerdo. Prepper. Loses possession. Being closed down. Salah. To Bennett. Gunnarsson. Cunningham. Just making sure that each pass is successful. When they'll see the chance for a forward pass, they'll flick a switch. Gunnarsson. Oh, guided through. Just to keep it to beat. That's a corner. Corner played in. Good defensive clearance there. Swung in from the corner. Played away, well away from goal. Lost the ball. The the players indicated there will place be a another two, a two minutes, minutes added on by the referee. The Closing him down. And the pass not completed, really. Well, everything to play for. So the referee's happy, and the second half gets underway. Jose Esquerdo. David Prepper. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. Put away, but not out of harm's way. He's got his shot off now. And it's gone for a corner. He's put in the corner. Duffy! Still heading for goal. And he did well to get to the ball first. That's the best I can say. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. Gross. David Prepper. Balogun. And time for the defender to clear the cross. And the away team want to make a change. Gregory Cunningham. How about Brighton's next match, Alan? They're playing Leicester City in their next match. It could be a backs-to-the-wall match for them. Esquierdo. Gross. Balogun. Put into the middle. Well, they've got to keep the crosses coming in. I'm sure in the end it will deliver something, but it didn't this time. Made the tackle. Esquierdo. This with a chance to go into the lead now. And that's a terrific goal to put them in front. That is a real mishap from the goalkeeper's point of view. But the striker isn't bothered, he's off on his lap of honour. Yeah, I think the keeper was just trying to be a little bit too cute, too clever, rather than just clearing his lines. Off we go again, 2-1. Here's Hoylett. They've got the ball back by that interception. Ezekiel Shalotto. Pascal Gross, just a period of keeping the ball for the team that are winning the match. Trying to find a way through here, probing away. Now he can cross it. Ezekiel Shalotto. 
Well, he's taken a touch there of the defender. It will be a corner. A substitution coming up as they look to make sure they hold their lead till the final whistle. It could be a chance. Well, he scored. It's a big moment for them in the match. They've pushed their lead now to two ahead. They played well to this point. Sometimes a two-goal lead can be a dangerous one. We'll see. Substitution. It's for the away team. Balogun. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. No wonder these fans are upset. Their team can't get hold of the ball. No chance, no sign at the moment of troubling the opposition's goal. Prepper. Ezekiel Shalotto. Esquiedo. Not a good challenge by the defender. The defender did well to finish it off. So not much time left at all. What does this mean, Alan, for their next game? Well, Cardiff City go up against Everton after this. And, uh, well, nobody's played well for them. They've got to do better. And five minutes remaining. Ezekiel Shalotto. Everyone wanting the ball, which is great for the team that are winning and keeping the ball and running down the clock in doing so. Not a nice challenge. For the ref, a decision, and the decision is yellow. I don't think anybody, least of all the player, can have any complaints about that. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of two minutes of added time. Continues to screen it well, despite the defender's best efforts. He says that's that. The inquest is almost starting now, so soon after the final whistle, about the reasons for this defeat. Yeah, disappointment all round, and maybe one or two will point fingers in the dressing room because I don't think they all gave it their full effort 100%, and that's inexcusable.